Hello everyone, welcome to Senior Pablo TV. So after discussing general form, the standard form of an ellipse, of the equation of an ellipse, now we're going to discuss the standard form of the equation of an ellipse to its general form. We have um, letter A, B, and C. For letter A, x squared over 25 plus y squared over 9 is equal to 1. Letter B, quantity x plus 3 raised to 2 over 24 plus quantity y minus 5 raised to 2 over 49 is equal to 1. And for letter C, x squared over 36 plus quantity y plus 4 raised to 2 over 64 is equal to 1. I will answer A and B, then your assignment is letter C. Okay. Let's begin letter A. Copy the given x squared over 25 plus y squared over 9 is equal to 1. It's, it's like solving rational equation. So, we need to multiply our equation to 25 and 9. So that our denominator will be equal to 1. So this will be cancelled out. Then 9 times x squared. So we have 9x squared. Plus, in this case, 9 will be cancelled out. So the remaining is 25y squared. Is equal to 25 times 9. Okay, let us multiply 25 times 9. 25 times 9, that is 5, carry 4. 9 times 5 is 45. 9 times 2, 18, plus 4, 19, 20, 21, 22. 22, 225. So, final answer, 9x squared plus 25y squared minus 225 is equal to 0. Okay. The other way around is getting the LCD. Okay. So, x squared over 25 plus y squared over 9 is equal to 1. So, getting the LCD, 25 times 9, 25 times 9, that is 225. 225 divided by 25, that is 9. 9 times x squared. So we have 9x squared. Copy the plus sign. Next, 225, the denominator, divided by 9. That is 25 times y squared. So we have y squared. Now 25y squared. And copy equal to 1. Now cross multiply. Cross multiply, we have 9x squared plus 25y squared is equal to 225 times 1, 225. So 9x squared plus 25y squared minus 225 is equal to 0. This is now our general form. Your GF. Now, let's try letter B. I will erase. Now let us try letter B. So copy the given. X plus 3 raised to 2 over 24 plus Y minus 5 raised to 2 all over 49 is equal to 1. Let us remove our denominator. So we need to multiply this to... 49 and 24. So we have 49 times our numerator, x plus 3 raised to 2, plus 24 numerator, y minus 5 raised to 2, is equal to 49 times 24. 49 times 24, that is 1170 
6. Now, the square of a binomial first. So let us expand. So we have 49. Square the first term, that is x squared. Multiply the first and the second times 2. So that is 6x plus square the second term, 3 squared, that is 9. Plus 24, expand. Square the first term, that is y squared. Multiply the first term and the second term, negative 5y times 2, negative 10y. Then square the second term, 5 squared, 25. Is equal to 1176. If you want to master the special products, go to our grade 8 playlist and watch our lesson 1 the special products. Now we can distribute 49. So 49 times x squared, that is 49x squared. Plus, we have 49 times 6. 49 times 6, 294x. Then, 49 times 9, that is 441. Plus, distribute, 24y squared minus 24 times negative 10, 240y, then 24 times 25, that is 600. 600 is equal to 1176. Next, of course, we need to equate to 0. So 49x squared, okay, let us arrange, plus 24y squared plus 294x. Minus 240y. Now combine like terms. 441 plus 600. 441 plus 600. That is 1041. Addition property of equality minus 1176 is equal to 0. We can combine this. So copy 49x squared plus. 24y squared plus 294x minus 240y. Combining, we have negative 135 is equal to 0. So this will be our general. Okay, now your assignment letter C. Our next lesson will be the hyperbola. So we're, non, we're now done in our circle, parabola, and the ellipse. Hyperbola will be the next lesson. Thank you for watching Cinderella.